On the 9th of March in Harare, the first state-owned travel agency was launched. The Civil Service Travel Bureau, CSTB, is a division of Courier Connect, a subsidiary of Zimpost, wholly owned by the government of Zimbabwe. This division offers affordable, reliable, confidential and accessible one-stop travel solutions for both the government, public and the private sector. Air ticketing, airport shuttle service, hotel reservations, door-to-door -door ticket delivery, visa and vaccination facilitations are just but some of the services offered by the Bureau. The Minister of Information, Communication, Technology, Postal and Courier Services, Honorable Super Manduanzira, was the guest of honor. Other guests who were present include Zimpost officials, airline representatives and government officials. I'm going to kindly ask the MD for Courier Connect, Mr. Isaac Muchokomori, to come up and give us a few words. A round of applause for Mr. Isaac Muchokomori as he comes up. We are delighted and highly honored this morning to have all of you here as our special guests to participate and celebrate the official launch of the Civil Service Travel Bureau, abbreviated CSTB. On behalf of Korea Connect, I would like to extend a cheerful welcome to you all. It gives me and the entire Korea Connect family a great pleasure to welcome you most cordially and to host you this morning. The Civil Service Travel Bureau is an innovation specifically designed to service government by government. As a state-owned logistics concern, we take pride in offering competitive travel services to all government departments, parastatals, state enterprises, quasi-government institutions, and the general public. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to express our most sincere hope and optimism that all of you will find value in being here today. The board in 2016 came up with new products to complement the company's traditional courier services, diversifying from only couriering goods and parcels to also passengers and also registering with the International Air Transport Association. Upon its appointment in September 2015, the current board was tasked to turn around the company within the, short, uh, within the shortest possible time, usually 100 days time. The main board of Zimpos directed its subsidiaries, namely Courier Connect and Zimpos Properties, to design to, and to realign their product services with the changing market trends that are now influenced by the fast-changing new information and communication technologies. Challenges that were militating the Kanban at that time were to do with the relevance of the Kanban products offerings to the customers. We are in a courier and parcel sending business. So every time you write an email and say, please find attached, you would have taken business away from us. Because we were supposed to print and send it to us then we, next day before 10 o'clock. Government has been looking for solutions to reduce travel costs. Courier Connect Civil Service Travel Bureau is the first state-owned travel agents providing efficient, affordable, secure, and convenient travel services for government officials, uh, the diplomatic community, uh, the NGO sector, and members of the public. Technological alternatives that are there today have been militating against our traditional uh, service offering. They, we, we, we were left with a product that is main, uh, rudimental and uh, less relevant to the market. The board in 2016 came up with the new products to complement the company's traditional courier services. Uh, we have six of these uh, projects which we are going to launch this year and we'll disclose this project as we launch them. It is the conviction of the Zimpos Board of Directors that our businesses must contribute 
immensely to Zimbabwe's economic blueprint, Zima said, and the 10-point plan that was enunciated by His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Zimbabwe, Comrade Robert Gabriel Mugabe. We saw great opportunity in venturing in the air travel of, of passengers, uh, which is a cousin product of the air courier parcels. We are in the business of couriering using air, and we felt maybe let's all diversify and, uh, and, and move the people who own the, pa the, the parcels. The cost of traveling had become expensive for many government departments, and government being any airline's biggest customer, the Board of Airlines chairperson reassured guests that by using CSTB, the cost of air travel would be cheaper for government institutions. Air Zimbabwe donated two tickets for the less privileged identified at Parenyatwa by CSTB. In order for us to even expound and endorse this achievement, Air Zimbabwe is contributing, is donating two tickets to Johannesburg for two disadvantaged uh, uh, people that may have been identified by Travel Service Bureau. On behalf of South African Airways, we commit to helping the uh, Civil Service Travel Bureau as much as we can to um, reduce this expenditure that they have been crying foul over. But all in all, we want to make sure that aviation becomes affordable to all. We are not viewed as being cannibalistic or um, overcharging them uh, in instances where this could have been avoided. This relationship is symbiotic in nature. My colleague spoke about cannibalism. I speak about symbiotic nature of our relationship. Every one of us lives to benefit from this noble achievement. The Minister of Information, Communication, Technology, Postal and Courier Services, Honorable Super Manduanzira, was grateful for this achievement made in his ministry and explained how it made government traveling costs cheaper as well as efficient. Public enterprises are the ones that drive all national economies. Uh, people talk about China growing so fast. What grew China's economy are public enterprises only because by 1975, they stopped thinking from within the box, they stopped thinking outside the box, and they thought without the box. And today, they are where they are. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to introduce to you the man who might think by the time he finishes his speech, will have learned a few lessons. Honorable Minister. Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, I uh, am here, and we all have gathered here to launch the first government-owned travel agents called the Civil Service Travel Bureau. From what I've been told, this is actually the first time it has happened since the independence in 1980. My ministry is pleased when its own state-owned enterprise take an initiative like this to diversify, to innovate, and to recreate their business model to align with the market opportunities at that particular moment. Government has been complaining that its travel budget is too high, and therefore we need to start cutting delegations that are traveling to ensure that we meet or we live within our means. They have recognized at Courier Connect that part of the reason why government travel business is, uh, travel costs are high is because we in government are being quoted high fares, expensive fares. That when you compare to fares that you're getting on the internet, it's a far cry. I've just given you one example. And they've seen an opportunity and they've come in to grab that opportunity to ensure that government travel costs are not as high as they are. It is my singular honor, ladies and gentlemen, and privilege to declare the Civil Service Travel Bureau officially launched. I thank you. Finally, the official opening was marked by the cutting of the ribbon and introductions took place of official staff as food and drinks were served. This was truly a milestone achievement in Zimbabwe and celebrated in style.
saying thank you ladies and gentlemen. Thank you to everyone for their contributions that uh, they made to this event. Now everyone is included. <laughs> um, um, I think I would also want to leave you with uh, the sayings of some of, the, of one of the speakers who spoke today. Uh, we say that the civil service travel Baru is waiting for you. Don't make us wait for too long. Come and be part of us and support us. Thank you.